After their spectacular 5-2 win over Toulouse and a hard-fought victory over Amiens, Brest went completely AWOL over the weekend, losing 3-0 to Loli Dijon. Their coach, Olivier Deloglio, was expecting an improvement against Bordeaux at the Stade Francis de Blay, where his side have only lost once all season at the hands of PSG. Well, Bordeaux had a pretty miserable December and January, losing four straight league games and going out of both cups. But they seem to have steadied the ship, winning in Nantes and drawing with Marseille to maintain a hope and beaten run against OM that stretches back to 1977. Ten minutes in, they went ahead through Yui Jo Huang. A brilliant header from a brilliant cross. Nicola de Preville, the provider, from a short corner. And the South Korean Huang getting his first goal in the league since early November. His fourth of the campaign. Brest had a good opportunity to draw level on the stroke of half time, though. Ludovic Bau with a little ball into Irvin Cardona. He was brought down by Pablo, and the referee pointed to the penalty spot. Not a huge amount of contact, but the decision was upheld by the VAR. However, Christian Batocchio denied by Benoit Costil. A 15th penalty save of his career. The Italian Batocchio hasn't been on target since his hat-trick against Strasbourg at the start of December. So Huang's goal separating the two sides at half-time. And the South Korean had another good opportunity from another corner early in the second half. The ball back in and there he was at the far post. This time his effort coming back off the woodwork. Gautier Larsson beaten on that occasion. But he was called into action then to deny Nicolas de Preville after a neat ball through from Yusuf Sabali. Brest reduced to 10 men on 68 minutes after a wild challenge from Jean-Charles Castelletto on Yassin Adli. Castelletto can have no arguments about that one. And in fact, apologising to the home fans on his way off. The chances continuing to come for Bordeaux. Tomo Basic, the Croatian midfielder, the next to try his luck, a brilliant save from Larsona. And then incredibly, with 10 minutes to go, Brest managed to find an equaliser. A ball in from the left-hand side, the header from Jean-Kevin Duvern and turned into his own net by Loris Benito, the unfortunate Bordeaux defender. Brest snatching the unlikeliest of points, having gone down to 10 men. Great header from Duverne, forcing Benito into making that error. And that was how it finished. Bordeaux will certainly consider it two points dropped. 1-1, the final score.